Okay, I'm wearing this outfit a lot, which is, I've worn this a lot anyway in videos, but it's literally my favourite jumper, so you're just going to have to get over it. But hi, hey, how are you? Um, Today I've got a, another come shot with me, and today we're going to be looking at, at and God say, I can't talk, I've been doing this for like 40 minutes. Um, We're going to be looking around River Island and Zara in a come shot with me today. I haven't bought anything, so there's not going to be a haul at the end of this video. I'm sorry, but um yeah so we're gonna look around zara first i know i've just been in zara um and i've actually bought something in zara fairly recently not clothing wise and it's a christmas present anyway but um i wanted to see what's new but there's not because zara comes out with stuff a lot like it turns those tables fairly quickly um so i wanted to see if there was anything new in um the zara in milton Keynes, as i said time and time again is rubbish it's so small and it's very cramped but I did get some footage in there because I'm filming it after the fact and then we're going in River Island which is bigger than Zara um, and having a look around there to see what they've got in as well. So stay watching if you want to see the come shot with me around Zara and River Island in Centre MK. So first stop we're going to head into Zara to see what they have got. This is what greets me as I enter the men's section in the Zara in Milton Keynes. Bought this with a tad price here, £99. What are they saying about that? 100 quid for that? I'm not sure about that. Um, I thought this was quite a nice sweatshirt, £27.99. Um, as we look through stuff you'll see £27.99 and £99.99 other prices that Zara like to do um, for some reason. I thought that was quite a nice grey jumper. Then we're going to have a look at shoes. I don't normally look at the shoes in store in Zara. They didn't have a price on so that was fabulous. Thanks for that. But these are the ones that I've looked up online. We looked at them on my last come shop with me when I did it online. I nearly bought them in the Black Friday sale. I really wanted to buy them. Um, but I might wait for the Christmas slash New Year sale. I just saw there was trainers and I didn't see those when I was looking around the store. Maybe I should have had a look at those. That was a very Noel Edmonds shirt. Um, this was a very nice, like, plevery jacket, but yeah, with a collar, ball collar, I don't need that. And then this is so nice. Although I've got one very similar to that from Zara that I got in the sale um, in the summer time from the Westfield um, one. I'll link the video up for that, for the haul that I did for that. Um, and then they got stuff like ranged in like tones and stuff so there was a brownie beigey coloured tone section here which was very nice with that very very big puffer jacket and then they've got like a grey section here with a nice grey um overcoat but as I say all the time only buy the coats in the sale because they always go in the sale this is a nice jacket though actually really nice and then I thought this was very um 90s tracksuit vibes kind of like that with the tealy colored stuff on and then they had like a collab with Spalding like which is a tennis brand that do the tennis balls and stuff so there we go I think it's a tennis brand and then they had like a wall of varsity jackets as well some of them like this blue electric blue one was really nice and then they had a really nice corduroy one that's lovely isn't it really like that um next we're going to go into river island to see what they have in store got a nice christmas window um i am filming this on the end of november i know this is going up the week before christmas but there we go so i come to the top of the escalators upstairs and first off i obviously gravitate towards the quarter zip sweatshirt for 35 pounds in a gray um that looks quite nice um and then this one is also quite nice with a little tiny bit of writing kind of like that vibe and of course i love a borg jacket i don't have a borg black jacket actually which is very surprising um so yeah um i did like this like i think it was suede to touch it looks like it's suede um kind of denim style jacket with a zip but suede so not denim but there you go that's quite a nice jumper though but 36 pound for that i think it's quite expensive don't you prices have obviously gone up because of covid and brexit but yes um quite a nice section of shirts here that are corduroy which are quite nice for winter oh, and that one is lovely the check in the gray kind of one gray and black obviously really nice oversized check love that um i really like these jackets as well they're like half and um, not half zips they're just zipped um i really like those i have got one very similar which is from 
H&M, especially as it hasn't been particularly cold recently. I think you can kind of get away with that if you layered it in the winter. Um, and that check shirt was really nice at the back, which I've got one very similar to from Next, which I actually got in a charity shop. So always worth looking in a charity shop. I am a very big advocate for the charity shop. I also quite like this plaid shirt. I don't, I don't think I've ever seen any like one in that colour, but it kind of reminds me one of my friend that my friend had when we were like kids back in like when we were like six or something for some reason that just flashed back into my head where he had that when he we had a party and we had face paint and he's got like tiger he's dressed as not dressed as a tiger but painted the tiger on his face this is the part of river island i don't like that trying to be dior not a fan of that i prefer a lot of the more minimal stuff like this is a nice jacket um in the black i don't have a black jacket but that's quite nice um, and then they've got this, which I thought was very interesting, like a quilted jacket. So it looks like a shirt, £38, but it looks quilted. Um, that's also quite nice as well, that check shirt as well. Um, what else do we have? Um, walking into the more casual section, and I think this is really now, is it? I can't remember. No, it's not. This is a more tailored section, actually. Scrap that. So like workwear-ish vibes kind of more modern workwear we've got jacket for example we that's a really nice color gray it's like a muted gray i was trying to see the price there you go you can kind of get the gist of the price there really liked that color i don't know how to describe it it's like a whitey gray which is really nice and obviously a lot they've had they've got a lot of jackets in beige and burgundy lots of different stuff um this shirt i thought was really nice it's kind of a bit watery colory kind of as well as a bit giraffe print in my opinion but very like watery colory kind of um really like that i think that was part of like their premium range because it's kind of like workwear ish like that orange um waistcoat was very bold um and another nice like jacket wallace shocker another jacket again um i had a lot of jackets in um and then i really liked I just wanted to have a look at what like a plain t-shirt would cost in here and these trousers were really nice as well actually in like the hound's tooth print um and then i actually really liked what the mannequin here was wearing that blazer i can never pull off a blazer i feel like i look like i'm wearing my dad's blazer kind of vibe but i thought this was really nice i would really love to pull off the um double-breasted blazer that would be so nice but i just can't and then they have this really nice puffer jacket in like my favourite minty greeny colour, sagey green colour if you will, really nice. Um, and then they also got around the corner, which I'm going to show you in a minute, some puffer gilets as well, which seems to be quite on trend at the moment as well. Ooh, so that was the shot with me around Zara and River Island. What did we think? I haven't been in River Island in a minute, so I don't know why I'm starting to say in a minute. I hate it when people say that. I haven't been in there in a while and they have got some new stuff in so I was pleasantly surprised about that. Zara, some of it they, some of it I hadn't seen before, some of it was a bit samey considering they normally turn out things fairly quickly. Like you can go in one week and they have something and then the next week they don't. Um, there wasn't really much new stuff really, a bit same old, same old but nonetheless quite nice. Um, nothing in River Island apart from a few things. I can't really remember. I'm filming this like four hours after the fact I've been in there um, and I've done a lot of videos and stuff today. So yeah, um, River Island had some okay stuff in I guess. But yes, um, I didn't buy anything. Thank the Lord. Nothing spoke to me that much. Although some of the stuff was really nice in Zara. But one, I'm going to wait for the sale. They had the boots that I actually nearly bought the boots on Black Friday because Zara had a Black Friday, like 40% off certain things. I nearly bought the brown boots that we've seen. I did it in, I saw it in, um, I did a come shop with me online and we saw them and I nearly bought them in store, not in store, I nearly bought them online last week on Black Friday. I don't know when this video is going to up, but I nearly bought them on Black Friday, but I didn't um, because they were like, they're like 79 99 and I think they were like 80 43 on the Black Friday sale. Nearly picked those up, but I didn't. Um, I might, if they go into the sale again in after Christmas, I will definitely pick them up. I'm going to be there on Christmas Eve on my laptop on Zara website, seeing if they've got sales. Hopefully they do, because I would like those boots at not that price, basically. And that's the only thing that really 
spoke to me. They've got loads of soft stuff in there though. Oh my god. Just touching things in there is just like heaven. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this quick little Zara and where else did I go? River Island come shop with me today. Um, and I hope you're proud that I did not in fact buy anything. So that's pat on the back for me because we know what I'm like. I'm like spend, spend, spend. And I have spent, spent, spent on loads of other stuff today anyway. But nothing spoke to me that much to buy anything in Zara or River Island. But yes, thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you're not already, please take the moment to subscribe. There is also, I'm going to link down below a playlist of all my Come Shop With Me's as well. If that is your jam and you want to check out some more Come Shop With Me's that I've done, I've done loads now. This was the year of the Come Shop With Me for me. Um, I started them last year and I've kept them going. This was the year of Come Shop With Me on my channel. Um, so if you like that kind of thing, I'll link the playlist down below and you can have a look through those. Um, but other than that, hope you're all staying safe if you're not already follow me on my instagrams as well they're always linked down below and stay safe and stay well and i'll see you in the next one bye